prepare yourself, because what astronomers are uncovering right now is beginning to turn our entire understanding of the universe on its head. The latest discoveries are so unexpected that even the world's leading scientists are starting to suspect that something monumental is approaching, something our current theories simply can't explain. As astrophysicist Andre Kutso of the Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory put it, we're in the business of letting the universe tell us how it works, and maybe it's telling us it's more complicated than we thought. With every new revelation, the James Webb Space Telescope is showing us that the cosmos may be far more intricate and far more mysterious than we ever imagined. Recently, researchers analyzed data from 30,000 early galaxies detected by Webb. What they found defied every expectation. These galaxies didn't fit into our current models of how the universe evolved. And as if that weren't enough, Webb examined 20,000 more, and the results were just as baffling. This vast cosmic survey suggests that what we've long believed to be the universe's steady expansion might not be what it seems. Some scientists now wonder, could the expansion itself be an illusion? If so, we may be standing at the edge of a scientific revolution, one that could reshape everything we thought we knew about the origin of the universe. Could it be that the Big Bang, that great cosmic explosion we've long believed began at all, is not the full story? Let's look at one discovery that's been shaking cosmology to its core. A recent study published in Nature Astronomy revealed a galaxy so large, so well-formed, that it challenges everything we thought possible in the early universe. Astronomers call it the Big Wheel, a cosmic giant whose light has traveled over 12 billion years to reach us. This enormous disk galaxy existed within the first 2 billion years after the Big Bang, when the universe was just 15% of its current age. Webb's detailed observations show that the Big Wheel rivals the largest spiral galaxies of today, both in size and in rotation speed. It's roughly three times larger than any other known galaxy from that same era, and among the most massive ever observed in the young cosmos. According to our current cosmological models, galaxies that formed this early should be small, chaotic, and irregular, cosmic toddlers still taking shape. But the big wheel is something else entirely, massive, structured, and impossibly mature for its age. And it isn't alone. Webb has identified multiple galaxies from this same early period that seem far too large and developed for their place in cosmic history. Yet even among these anomalies, the big wheel stands out, the largest, the brightest, the most astonishing of them all. But the surprises don't stop there. Webb's most recent data has unveiled something even more unsettling, evidence that could change how we think about dark energy the mysterious force driving the universe's expansion. For decades, dark energy was thought to be constant, an invisible pressure steadily pushing galaxies apart. But now, new observations hint that this force may be changing over time, evolving in a way that challenges our very notions of space, time, and cosmic destiny. If that's true, we could be standing on the brink of one of the greatest discoveries in modern astronomy, a revelation that may rewrite the very story of how the universe began and where it's ultimately headed. This new discovery from the early universe is shaking the very foundation of modern cosmology, a framework that traces its roots back to Albert Einstein himself. While more data is needed to confirm the findings, even some of the most cautious scientists are beginning to take notice. Professor Afer Lahav of University College London admits that the mounting evidence is becoming difficult to ignore. The discovery of dark energy back in 1998 was already one of the most shocking moments in astrophysics. Until then, scientists believed that after the Big Bang, the universe's expansion would gradually slow down, pulled back by the force of gravity. But when teams of astronomers in the United States and Australia looked deeper, they found the exact opposite. The universe wasn't slowing down, it was accelerating. 
Something, some mysterious force was pushing galaxies apart faster and faster. With no better explanation, they named it dark energy, a term that captures both its mystery and our ignorance of what it truly is. Even though we don't yet know what dark energy is, astronomers can measure its effects by tracking how fast galaxies move away from one another at different points in cosmic history. At first, many assumed this force was constant, unchanging throughout time. But recently, the Dark Energy Spectroscopic Instrument began to detect something odd, hints that dark energy's strength may have shifted over billions of years. Most scientists expected that anomaly to disappear with more data. It didn't. After a year of new observations, the results only grew stronger. Professor Seishadri Nadathar from the University of Portsmouth explains, We've run every test we can think of and the signal isn't going away. The data are telling us that dark energy is behaving more strangely than we ever imagined. Meanwhile, the James Webb Space Telescope has added even more intrigue. Webb's deep field observations suggest that in the early universe, dark energy may have behaved very differently than it does today. According to Nobel laureate Adam Reichs, Webb's measurements show something deeply unsettling. The rate at which the universe expands, driven by dark energy, seems to depend on how it's measured. When scientists study the cosmic microwave background, the faint afterglow of the Big Bang, they get one value for the universe's expansion rate. But when they calculate it using our standard cosmological model, they get another. This mismatch is known as the Hubble tension, and it's one of the biggest unsolved problems in modern astrophysics. The contradiction implies that something fundamental about our understanding of the universe may be missing. Perhaps dark energy isn't constant after all. Perhaps it changes, shifting across time and space, subtly altering how the universe evolves. If that's true, then not every part of the cosmos would share the same history. Some regions might have expanded faster or earlier than others, meaning their clocks tick differently. And that brings us to one of the most fascinating ideas in modern cosmology, a theory known as timescape cosmology. According to this model, the universe's apparent expansion isn't driven by a mysterious dark energy at all, but by time itself. In regions filled with galaxies and matter, time may flow more slowly, and the vast empty voids between them it may race ahead. Imagine two identical atomic clocks, one placed deep inside a galaxy, the other floating alone in the emptiness between galaxies. Over cosmic timescales, the clock in the galaxy might tick up to a third slower than the one in the void. Now stretch that effect across billions of years. In the emptier parts of the universe, more time may have passed, billions of years more, compared to the dense matter-filled regions. If this theory is correct, then the universe doesn't have a single universal age. Instead, each region of space has its own tempo, its own rhythm of time. And that means our familiar picture of a 13.8 billion year old universe might only be part of the story. The true cosmic timeline could be far more complex. A symphony of times, each playing its own note in the grand orchestra of the cosmos. If timescape cosmology is correct, then the age of the universe might not be the same everywhere. In the vast cosmic voids, where matter is sparse and gravity is weak, time could be flowing faster, meaning those regions might be older than the denser parts of space filled with galaxies and clusters. And here's where it becomes truly fascinating. Because so much more time has passed in the voids, these regions have undergone greater expansion. In simple terms, space itself has been stretching more in these emptier areas. So, if you were observing an object on the far side of a cosmic void, it would appear to be moving away from you faster than an object on the near side, not because of dark energy, but because the space between you has expanded more quickly over billions of years. Now imagine this effect across the entire universe. Over time, these vast voids begin to dominate the cosmos,
growing ever larger and more numerous as they expand faster than their denser surroundings. The result? When we look out into the universe, it creates the illusion of an accelerating expansion. Even though, in this model, there is no mysterious dark energy at all, the differing flow of time itself could be the key. Back in 2017, astronomers at the University of Canterbury in New Zealand tested the Timescape Cosmology model against real observations. To their surprise, it fit the data slightly better than the standard Lambda CDM model that has long been the foundation of cosmology. But Webb's discoveries have added yet another twist. When scientists analyzed 30,000 galaxies captured by the telescope, they noticed something extraordinary. A surprising number of them were rotating in the same direction. According to the traditional Big Bang theory, the early universe should have been turbulent and chaotic, producing galaxies spinning at random. Yet this unexpected uniformity hints at a deeper pattern, as if the cosmos itself began with a subtle, primordial spin. And that idea has led some researchers to an even more audacious thought. What if our universe was born inside a rotating black hole? This concept, known as the black hole universe hypothesis, proposes that what we perceive as our entire universe could actually be the interior of an enormous black hole existing in another reality. In this view, every black hole might spawn its own universe, each with its own laws of physics and flow of time, a cosmic branching of realities hidden within one another. These ideas are bold, even unsettling, yet they remind us of something profound. The more we learn about the cosmos, the more mysterious it becomes. Each new discovery, each observation from telescopes like Webb, peels back one layer of the cosmic story, only to reveal a deeper, stranger chapter beneath. Perhaps the universe is not a simple tale of expansion and time, but a vast, interconnected symphony of galaxies and voids, of matter and energy, of time itself bending and flowing in ways we are only beginning to grasp. And somewhere out there, beyond the edge of what we can see, the universe continues to whisper its secrets, inviting us to listen, to wonder, and to keep searching for our place in the grand design of it all.